Football is a tough sport. A hard strike to the head is not uncommon. 21-year-old Towson University linebacker Zane Ventimiglia suffered not one, but two concussions last season. He didn't see either hit coming, but felt them afterwards. I remember being pretty off kilter, not very, uh, wasn't able to balance well. Athletic director Nathan Wilder says right after injury, trainers have to rely partly on subjective tests, such as how an athlete looks or says he feels. The kids are pretty resilient, so they'll, they'll, they'll take a hit and they come off and they're okay, and then maybe five minutes later they tell you they're not. Now there's a new portable device designed to give an objective assessment. The brain scope measures brain waves. When somebody hits their head, it changes the brain electrical activity pattern. It's designed so a trainer can easily use it. There's a disposable headset with sensors that attach to the injured athlete's forehead. A smartphone with specialized software picks up the readings. Using the sophisticated algorithms that the BrainScope One implements, it looks for that set of changes that are distinctive of a traumatic brain injury. The readings can help trainers decide whether the athlete needs more advanced medical screening. A real-time scan for brain injury without hours of delay. I'm Marty Salt reporting.